Alrighty, what's up everybody? Peter Gilma here on this Friday afternoon. Back to you again with another video. I right here on Metal God 669. Thank you all for watching this video. Been a while since I did a video on this channel. But back here again for another sh another uh, video on this channel. Uh, make sure you like this video and hit that fucking subscribe button down below. Let's get this channel to 1,000 subscribers. Uh, just about 830 uh, subscribers right now. So hopefully by the summer we'll get to 1,000 subscribers. Let's see what happens with that. Uh, so subscribe to this channel and my other channels. All the links are down below in the description box. Friend me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. And share those, these videos all over the internet. And thank you once more for your support. Alright, on this cold, sunny, uh, Friday afternoon, weekend is finally here, yay, first weekend in March, yay, well, you know, I was watching the, uh, the Met game earlier today, they were losing 4-3 in the, in the ninth, and then they came back to tie it, like, do you always do, yeah, but they ended in a tie, so, so they're 0-1-1 on the spring Season no it doesn't count, but I it's good to see baseball back on my TV. Yes, so we'll see what happens with with that. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, what I want to do in this video, as the title below says, well, another video, another death in the world of uh, professional wrestling. As uh, last night it was reported that Japanese wrestling legend. Legend. Understand the word legend. And it's not Roman Reigns, Sean's View Entertainment, you piece of shit. Japanese legend Hayabusa uh, passed away at the age of 47. Um, you know, he had a lot of uh, problems recent, you know, over the years with his, uh, you know, he, he was paralyzed from, the, from you know, the waist, the neck down. And, uh, you know, he's a great wrestler for, for when he was in, um, wrestling in the, the, uh, the 90s. And then he broke his neck in 2001. Ugh. I, I mean, I still, I still watch that video and I have, ugh. It's just not a good landing when he, when he tried to, for that, uh, that, uh, what was he trying for? He was trying for a, uh, springboard moonsault and the rope broke. Or, or, you know, like he botched the, coming off it and... That's what it is. It's yes, there is a tail in front of me. Zuzu! Why are you always in my videos? Get out of here! Stop it! <laughs> Zuzu won't let me do videos anymore. He's like, she's the troll! Get out of here, troll! But I digress. So anyway. Alright, now you're in my shot. Get the hell out of here. Fucking cat. You fucking idiot! I digress. So, um... Uh, what do you? Uh, so yeah, Hayabusa died at the age of forty-seven. Uh, his real name is I'm gonna probably botch this name. Aiji Izaki. It's E I J I E Z A K I. Aiji Izaki. Uh, who's found dead Thursday due to uh sub arachnoid hemorrhage. <laughs> That sounds that sounds disgusting. Uh, if you don't know what it is, it's a bleeding of the brain usually found in elderly people who have hit their head. So, you know, he's he w been paralyzed for numerous years. He finally uh, uh, he was confined to like 2011 and I think around 2012, 2013. Uh, at a I think it was a, a new Jap not a new Japan. It was one uh, all Japan show I think. Uh, he walked the ring unassisted, uh, nobody there to help him, and that was a great sign. I thought, like, you know, he was going to come out of it, and, um, I know he'll never wrestle again, but, uh, but it was a good sign that he was walking, and, you know, he was going to beat this, um, paralysis, and then, you know, he's going to get feelings back in his arms and in his, in his extremities and everything else, but, Sadly, yesterday he succumbed to this hemorrhage, 
and uh, passed away at the age of 47. Now, for those of you who don't know who Hayabusa is, and I know there are a lot of you out there, a bunch of you Mark, excuse me, a bunch of you Marks out there, uh, basically he was an icon of Japanese wrestling in the 1990s, uh, mostly fighting in uh, FMW, which is Frontier Martial Arts Wrestling. Uh, a lot of people call it Funk Mountain Wrestling, because basically Terry Funk was the god of that fucking promotion. Uh, but he also um, appeared in All Japan, CMLL, and even ECW. Uh, he was on that, I think, a couple of shows leading up to Heat Wave 98, where he and uh, uh, the wrestler formerly known as Hakushi uh, faced off against uh, Rob Van Dam and... Uh, and Sabu for the tag team titles, when Sabu and RVD were the tag team champions at the time. Ve that was an, a very good match, a very underrated match in um, ECW history. But, uh, you know, go go on YouTube it. It's a very good match. Commentary is great from uh, Joey Styles. And uh, he, uh, he was the innovator of the Falcon Arrow. And uh, also he innovated the Phoenix Splash, which... Seth Rollins do, uh, does, well, he does on occasion, so I guess he uh, pays homage to Hayabusa, uh, and pretty much was a Sabu clone, and if you've watched FMW and all the death matches um, from FMW, Hayabusa was in most of them, uh, most notably his uh, electric bomb cage match with uh, Sabu, where Sabu ran into the cage and the whole cage blew up in his face. You know, and the cage blew up, and Hayabusa and uh, and the referee and Sabu were all on the ground while the cage blew up. That was pretty fun. So you can just check that out. Um, I think he's had some um, matches with uh, Onita here and there, but mostly with Sabu. Sabu was like his longtime rival, and uh, you know, I want, I want I wonder what Sabu had to say about it. I know a lot of um, superstars have said on their Twitters about um about Hayabusa's passing, but I haven't read most of them, but, um, I would think they, they would say good things about the man. Um, like I said, I, I only saw him once, that was that ECW Heat Wave 98 show, um, and the death matches that he was in, they was fucking, ugh. I hope you have a good stomach to watch those matches, because they are freaking, yeah, it makes you want to throw up after a while, not that I did, but, yikes! So I can say about that, but you know, just a, another sad day in the world of wrestling. I mean, we lost uh, Axel Rotten a couple weeks ago. You know, I and Mike Sharp we lost uh, about a month or so ago, and you know, all the other people have died this year. You know, we're losing a lot of freaking people this year. I mean, we lost David Bowie, Lemmy, Natalie Cole. Uh, Hans from Die Hard, uh, and so many others so far. I mean, this year is this year's not been so kind. I mean, it's already March the fourth, and we lost about like almost 20, 20, 25 people. You know, in celebrity land. You know, you don't know when you don't know when we gonna pass on. I could pass on tonight for all I care, but I'm not. But that's not up to me. That's up to the man up there, and I don't think he has. It's, it's my time yet. My time is like when I'm like 150. If I live that long. <laughs> Probably live to like 120. But of course I'm immortal. So. Yeah, but at, this, at the rate I'm going, I don't know. I digress. So uh, that's all I got to say about that. Um, just, uh, I don't have a drink, so I can't do my usual toast to uh, the faithful departed. But uh, I will take this time to... Uh, Say a moment of silence and give a moment of silence for the man, the myth, the legend, Hayabusa san. Alright. So, uh, if you, anybody has any uh, memories of Hayabusa, if they have any matches that, that you want me to watch from Hayabusa, not the ones I already watched, but I'll probably watch it again just for fun. Well, let me know in the comments section or you can send me a message. Uh, on this channel or any one of my other channels uh, about what videos to watch um, you know other things that you want me to watch from Hayabusa's in-ring career uh, in the 90s 
Uh, I, I'll probably watch ECW Heat Wave 98 um, with Hayabusa and Okushi against RVD and uh, Sabu probably later on this weekend just to reminisce a little bit. So, so if you have any memories or if you have anything to say about the life and career of Hayabusa, put it down below in the comment section. Uh, if you have any wrestling questions, it could be about Hayabusa. Uh, put it down below in the comment section. Or anything, if you have any other wrestling questions, WWE, TNA, Ring of Honor, New Japan, anything else in the world of professional wrestling, put it down below as well for TGC25 coming next Sunday. Uh, you can also ask me questions about religion, music, movies, politics, sex, anything else, and I'll get to them as quickly as I can. Deadline is next Saturday, so you have just about a week to go to send in wrestling questions, wrestling or anything else. Questions mostly, most of the questions I got have been wrestling, so it is what it is. But I got seven questions so far, hoping for a little bit more. So maybe I'll put a cap on it if I get like more than 20 questions. I'll put a cap on it and I'll save them for the next Peter Gilmore QA video, whenever that'll be. So send in those wrestling questions, your music questions, move, movies, sports, uh, religion, politics, anything else you want me to talk about. Put it in the description box in this video, I mean the comments section in this video or any one of my other videos that are coming up. Or you can inbox me on this channel or any one of my other channels, links are in the description box. Uh, you can hit me up on Facebook, just, just type in Peter Gilmore, you'll find me somewhere. You can leave me your questions in my inbox. Or you can uh, send me your questions via Twitter at my handle, at Gilmore Inc, I-N-C in capital letters. So uh, you can follow me on Twitter. I always post all my videos, uh, and uh, you can follow what I'm doing. Usually, I haven't been doing much of that, but um, I'm, I'm mostly on Twitter now. So you can send me your, your questions via Twitter. Once again, at my handle at Gilmore Inc is the uh, handle. I N C in capital letters. All the links, my social media links are in the description box. So doesn't doesn't pay to say I forgot what channel you were on. You know, but it is what it is. So, I know the sun is in my face, so I don't really give a fuck. So, that is it. So, send in all your wrestling questions. And, uh... Yeah, and tell Zuzu to stop being involved in my videos, fucking cat. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, now she's probably gonna bite me now. <laughs> Get your freaking cat out of my face, you fucking cat. Ding, your food is ready. Uh... So yeah, so leave me your, your comments and your memories about the life and times, the life and memory and career of Hayabusa down below in the comments and leave me your wrestling questions or any other questions you might have for TGC25 and that's all I gotta say about that. So thank you all for watching this video. Have a great rest of your Friday afternoon and Friday evening. Uh, uh, might be doing a rant video later today about how YouTube sucks! But I'll get to that later. So, you got this video on the Metal God 69 channel. And then you got a rant on the on the ever-popular PG Rants channel coming up later tonight. So, you got two for the price of one. And check out all my other videos. My uh, Lucha Underground review. My Ring of Honor review. My uh, NXT review on the Peter Gilmore Wrestling channel. As well as Kill Demon 669 and TGC Reborn. I'll be doing TGC 24 uh, probably next week sometime, probably Tuesday or Wednesday, uh, which I'm hoping to be my Ring of Honor 40th anniversary review. Um, I'm actually going to look to see if uh, WatchWrestling.ch has the uh, pay-per-view. I'm going to watch. Uh, I'm going to try to watch at least most of it, and I'll give you my review of it um, probably Tuesday or maybe Thursday, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. All right, for now, I'm Peter Gilmore. Rest in peace, Hayabusa-san. You are a legend, and... Hopefully having great death matches in the sky with the other uh, legends that have passed on before us. So, um, that's all I gotta say about that. Uh, thank you for watching this video. And like, share, comment, hate, I don't give a fuck. Well, if you hate, you're a really cold-hearted bitch. So, uh, that's all I gotta say about that. L smash that like button to death. Smash that subscribe button to death as well. And that's pretty much all I gotta say. So... I'm going to go out to get something to eat with the woman, because I'm hungry as fuck, and uh, that's all I got to say. So thank you for watching, Hayabusa, 
rest in peace, my brother. And uh, to all of you out there, Konnichiwa, Ichiban. Peace out.